Who is on the list for you that is absolutely the person you could not under any circumstances vote for? For me, Donald Trump is the new addition. There are a couple of people that have already been on the list, and I'm going to go from the bottom up here of who's on my list. The absolute bottom of my list, Mike Huckabee. Mike Huckabee is only slightly worse than Jeb Bush because Mike Huckabee says and does a same of the a lot of the same progressive, outrageously wrong, crappy things that Jeb Bush does, believes, and has done. But Mike Huckabee also uses Jesus to justify doing it, which is reprehensible that you would use your faith as supposedly a conservative to woo people to go to your website and buy your crap, Mike Huckabee, and try to get you elected only to build yourself up, to use your faith to do that, that is absolutely the lowest of the low. I mean, he's essentially one of those guys like in that Steve Martin movie, Leap of Faith, too. I mean, going town to town, I mean, talking about Jesus and healing people for money. He's shaking snakes and telling you to drink the strychnine for Jesus when all he's really interested in is himself. And Mike Huckabee? You want to challenge me on that? Sit down here. I'll put you on this program. I'll put you on our program. I'll challenge you. I'll meet you on any street corner anywhere in America and debate you on this stuff. I know your track he record. He won't come on our show. I kn- no, he won't because he's afraid of us, just like the other people. Mike Huckabee, I know who you are. I've got your track record. I've got the information on you. I know your record as governor in Arkansas. I remember when you called the conservatives in Arkansas Shiite Republicans, comparing them to terrorist extremists in the Middle East because you didn't simply like the fact that they didn't want you to raise the taxes on the people of Arkansas. I know that you've been selling your website name and the people on that that sign up for your site so people can target them to sell essentially what I call snake oil. I know who you are. And using Jesus to do it, you're despicable. Slightly up on that list is uh, Jeb Bush because he does virtually all those same things. He just hasn't invoked the name of Jesus. So those two, absolutely at the bottom of the list for me. Yeah, well, and those two, I mean, oftentimes will trade off back and forth on who is the actual worst of the worst. I mean, Jeb Bush is going to come out and say something in the next week that's going to put a shim back on the other side for me, and then Mike Huckabee's going to come back. And so they battle for the worst of the worst in my mind. You know, you know what it is? Uh, it, these two are so bad, I would rather vote for Jim Webb. The Democrat former senator of Virginia before I'd vote for them. I, how bad is it? I'd vote for Lindsey Graham before I'd vote for those two. Here's the, I, That's how awful it is. They're incrementally better than Obama. Let me think about that. You want to talk about progressive? Let me think about that. Seriously, let that marinate for a second. Don't get me wrong. I'll, I'll say on. they're better than Obama. No, but... I'm no. That's what I'm challenging you on. I don't know if they are. I can make an argument they're worse than Obama. At least Obama's honest about it. At least Obama, you know what you're getting. Yeah. With Jeb Bush and Mike Huckabee, that's they fair. wrap it in being caring. That's we fair. care more than you, but we're conservative. And they get in there and they do the same crap. In fact, if it hadn't been for George W. Bush, we wouldn't have Obama because he that's pretended to be the true. conservative, did the same stuff, and Everybody said, well, we don't like all that crap that's going on that's not conservative, but they thought it was, and ran to Obama. So I put them on the same par with him. You're right. You're right. All horrible people.